everybody, it's Blue Ducky and welcome back to another doll review. In this video, I have the Party Ghouls Rochelle to unbox and review for you guys. She comes with seven snap-in accessories. Here's a look at the back of the box where you can read her full name, Rochelle Goyle. She's the daughter of the Gargoyles. Awesome artwork. She comes with the Rouge, uh, I don't know how to pronounce that word, Rouge purse and snap and accessories and also available in the party goal line is Abby Bomberable and Venus McFly Trap. Here's a look at all the different little accessories that this Rochelle comes with. Um, there is her purse that's this cute little green gargoyle with this black bow and the black bow is considered one of the snap-in accessories since you can remove it. And then we have a green firefly. Not a firefly, that's a dragonfly. Sorry, a dragonfly. And then this piece, which I think is meant for the headband. And then two green and two pink flowers that have the little Florida de lis symbol in the middle. Okay, so we'll check out her outfit before we put in any of the deco pieces. Here's a look at her face. I always think Rochelle has a very pretty face. I like the shape of her nose and lips and overall I think she's just really pretty. Um, she has pink blush and pink lips. I like the skin tone is granite because she's supposed to be a gargoyle. Here's a look at the black headband that she comes with, which has three different deco piece slots. Her pink and green hair is kind of messy. This is like straight out of the box. It did not come out super well. Um, I think there's supposed to be curls, but it just straight out of the box looks messy already, which is disappointing. Here's a look at her cute gargoyle wings and the slots in her back that you have to clip them into. Straight out of the box, they are not attached. You have to attach them yourself. Going down into her outfit, she has this black suspender belt piece, which you can see has holes for the different deco pieces. And then underneath that is a blue top with a pink ruffle down the front. And then her skirt, which is a dark and light pinks. I see the same um, pattern as the deco pieces, that kind of flower with the fleur de lis symbol and also uh, dragonflies decorating it. And finally, here's a look at her shoes. The front has that big fleur de lis and then there's holes on each side of the ankle for a deco piece. Hey, and here is a look at her with all the deco pieces in. I chose to do the big one on her headband, then two on her belt with, uh, well, the two fla pink flowers on her suspender part, and then the dragonfly on her belt. Her purse is on her arm, looking really cute. And then I put the two green flowers on her pink shoes. So, uh, overall, I think she is a gorgeous doll. Uh, my overall rating for her, I'm going to do 9 out of 10. And there's just one thing that bothers me on this doll. And that is the color of her top is a sky blue, which doesn't match anything else on this doll. Her hair is that minty green the deco pieces are the minty green that match the purse and the skirt of the dress. And then you have a sky blue top that doesn't match anything and that bothers me. <laughs> I wish they would have matched the color to the rest of the green blues in her hair, her outfit, and um, everything else on this doll. So that's just the one little tiny thing that I didn't like. So that's why I gave it 9 out of 10. She's still a beautiful doll that doesn't bother me enough not to recommend her to um, Monster High collectors or people who like Rochelle will definitely like this doll. So thank you so much for watching this review and I'll see you next time. Bye!